Hey guys, this here is Ben with Taprack Blog. Today I want to talk about recommending gear. Um, I see a lot of people recommending gear that's good enough and um, basically using the good enough term to recommend subpar gear. When it comes to gear that people trust their life to, you should not be recommending subpar gear for any reason whatsoever. Uh, this goes for guns, this goes for mags, this goes for holsters, this goes for sights, this goes for anything that goes into someone's EDC kit that they trust their life to. The term good enough makes me think that you really don't care that much about your life or you don't care about the lives of the people that you're recommending gear to. So if you ever do recommend gear to people, make sure that it's been tested and that it actually works. And I'm not really talking about shooting 50 rounds, shooting 100 rounds. I am talking about gear that has been thoroughly tested and gear that has been used in a service capacity for years and has a track record of working, right? Because when people go to defend their life, that's like the most important thing in the world to them. You should not be recommending subpar gear. And if you do recommend subpar gear, stop it. Seriously, don't do it. Recommending gear to people is a responsibility that should not be taken lightly. Uh, if you recommend a subpar piece of gear and then someone chooses to carry that and then that somehow gets them hurt or that somehow puts them at a disadvantage in the fight, I believe that while you are not legally responsible, um, if you are a moral person, you are morally responsible for what you did. This has been with Taprak Blog. Thank you guys for watching. I will post something else for you soon. Thanks, guys.